Dr. Edward Lanieski, board certified orthopedic surgeon at the American Osteopathic Academy of Orthopedics, or the AOAO, here in Colorado Springs at the world famous Broadmoor. And I am here today with Dr. Gary Ulrich. Dr. Gary Ulrich is the president of the foundation for the AOAO. Uh, he uh, went to CCOM, right? And then you did your residency at Detroit Osteopathic Hospital. Uh, that's where I was born, actually, oh. as a kid. No longer there. It's just right. a piece of rubble right now. Right. Uh, you did your uh, fellowship, though, at Michigan State in sports medicine. Was that with Herb? Correct. Uh, Herb Ross. Herb Ross. Back in the old days, when you could you could really be a good sports medicine doc there, and um, and now he's the and you are now a professor at IU and you're teaching medicine there and you're teaching all the medical students in the world's largest medical school, mm -hmm. and um, you got a great program going with the foundation right now. You've got this match program. Why don't you tell us a little bit about what's happening? Because this is kind of exciting that you were the first to go out and forge a new relationship so that we could get more money for research. So why don't you tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, we are the first um, subspecialty group to uh, enter into a fundraising collaboration with the AOF, the American Osteopathic Foundation. And we have a dollar for dollar match program in place with the American Osteopathic Foundation for up to $60,000. So we are going to fund, our goal is to fund um, six $10,000 research grants so that our residents and fellows can undertake meaningful quality scholarly projects. Hopefully this will help translate into more publishable works out of our profession. Um, increase the awareness of the profession, both in the orthopedic surgery discipline and also in the osteopathic discipline, hence uh, the collaboration with the AOF. Yeah, and, and to have a true osteopathic research, because that's been in the, in the past, that's kind of been neglected a bit, not that they weren't trying, it's just that that collaboration of actually putting money down and making this a priority You've been the person to kind of spearhead this. So there's going to be six $10,000 grants that are going to be available after we raise these funds, which I know you will. Uh, and the goal is to get a total of 60, but 30 from, from the AOAO, 30 from AOF. And uh, tell us, like, if you wanted to donate, where, where would you go to go ahead and donate? Well, at this meeting here at the Broadmoor, uh, during our exhibitor um, reception uh, this evening, actually. Um, we're going to have our kickoff fundraising uh, campaign, and we're going to have a, a fun way to do that. We've uh, hired what's called a money machine, so people can actually buy a ticket to get in the money machine for $50, and then they can, uh, in a certain amount of time, grab as much money as they can grab <laughs> and either match match their $50 investment or better it, and um, obviously all the ticket proceeds go to the uh, AOAO Foundation, and that'll start our fundraising to get to our uh, $30,000 goal, which is, uh, which is, what's nice about our um, matching program is that we don't have to raise the $30,000 all at once. So if we can raise, excuse me, if we can raise $5,000 in a short amount of time, the AOF will match that $5,000 right up front. So we'll have a $10,000 grant, and we'll just continue to do that over the next three years till we get to our six. That's, that's interesting. So um, if they wanted to donate online, is there a possibility that they could do that? That would be done through the uh, website, uh, the AOAO.org website. There's so again, a, that's AOAO.org? Yes. And, and they will hit the foundation? Yes, there's a foundation link which describes our mission statement and some of the things, uh, projects that were are un, under in progress, uh, some awards, some scholarships. We already have a $5,000 AOAO grant uh, in place. And there's a donate tab there um, for folks to donate. Easy, easy to easy. click, takes all your credit cards, everything else that you need so you can get points back and, and still do a good job for, for the Osteopathic Foundation. So if you really wanna see true osteopathic research, 
that's not only funded by the AOAO, but by the AOF. Go to AOAO.org and donate now. Gary, it's a pleasure meeting you. And this is Dr. Edward Lanieski here at the AOAO, the American Osteopathic Academy of Orthopedics in Colorado Springs at the beautiful Broadmoor. Take care.